Gemulicatite. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> this looks like it says Gemutlicite. Uh, Gemeclicite. That works. I'll, I'll stick with the Landsman Award. <laughs> Gamutlikite. Gamutlikite is warmth, and friendliness, friendliness, hospitality. All day long. Absolutely. My husband and I took our first lessons here in 1960. We signed up for a second four week session and then we started buying a family season pass. Well, I had a couple of the guys that I'd taken lessons from come to me and say, you know, why don't you, why don't you try out for the ski school? And I said, oh dear God, I'm too old. <laughs> that was 43 years ago. <laughs> there's teachers that, that know how to teach and there's teachers that understand technically what's going on. And then there's teachers that just embody it all. Um, her ability to wrap people in and respond to her. It's one of the most important traits as a ski instructor, and she has it in spades. I am a very fortunate person because she is my mom. She has parlayed what she taught me to all of her, all of her students. She really has. I mean, people come up to me and say, oh, you're Donna's daughter? She has a heart for people as much as skiing. And she's taken a unique ability to combine those two loves and those two passions and serve her community for 40 years. It's all about having fun. And then we do a lot of safety. And then we do a little bit about left and right. I was encouraged to join PSIA, which is Professional Ski Instructors of America. And I just got my 40-year pin from them. Yeah. <laughs> what a run. How do you beat that? Yeah. <laughs> we were fortunate enough to have Donna as our board member to represent our region at Central Oregon. She served on that board for over 10 years and she did a great job. The board position was an elected position by my peers and that was tough to do because that was a, a mail-in ballot and no one ever had a stamp. <laughs> <laughs> she is really an asset to the community. She's an asset to Hoodoo, and she's an asset to Sisters Country. I feel very fortunate that she is my mom. She's taught me, but she's taught the world too. It also transfers to the staff at Hoodoo. Um, her welcoming, her genuineness, her passion for, for being better at everything that she does. And I see that effect that she has had by their enthusiasm to learn and to be better and to grow up and be like her. <laughs> Why do I keep coming back? Should I say, answer that honestly? Yeah. I hate the gyms. <laughs> it's the people you meet. It's the fabulous people that you meet on a daily basis. You come up to Hoodoo and you know the other people who are skiing around you, the other people who are in the lodge, and it's, it's also just a fun, uh, small town feel. In the last 10 years as I've grown up somewhat older. <laughs> the focus has been to bring back the ladies. Maybe they skied in high school, maybe they skied in college and then they got married and they have, you know, the 2.2 children now. And that's really been my focus. It's the ongoing challenge. So that at the end of that lesson, they will say, I really did have fun.